It's me. Heather. Heather. And today I am going to speak a little extra softly. Because today's sound assortment theme is soft things. So I'm going to try and keep my voice a little bit softer than usual. Let me know if you like it. And I have collected a bunch of props to use with you. And I put them over there so you can hear me walk around you. But the first thing that I want to do is start with a soft ear massage. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to gently run my fingers, not the nails, uh, run my fingers over your ears. I'm not showing you mine because I have really big ears. But we're not very... uh, so I'm going to go from the top all the way down your ear like this. And if you do this to yourself, go ahead. You'll hear it sounds sort of like a wave. Like that. Okay? Come here. Slowly down the ear, other side. Oh, one second. If you have headphones on, you probably hear crickets. It's cricket season. There's nothing I can do about it. They're out there, and they're loud, so they'll be here for a couple months. I hope that it doesn't distract you too much. They're helping with soft chirps. softly top to the bottom now I'm going to take my hand I'm going to draw it back like that so I'm going laterally now I'm going to come around your head to do it, so you should hear me behind you now. And I'm going to do your right ear first. Very soft.
wear your left ear first. It's just my hand. both ears. Should be a little bit harder for you to hear me. You should feel like my hands are really on your ears. something that you wash with like this and it's very soft it's made of this very soft netting that has an elastic quality to it. I personally um, I don't like loofahs. Not, uh, not for any other reason aside from I have issues with certain textures. Um, candles, conditioner, lotion. They all have a texture that I really, I don't gives me the heebie-jeebies, and the loofah gives me the same heebie-jeebies. But, if you hold a loofah next to your ear and move it, <laughs> it looks like a hair bow. <laughs> loofah hair bows. All the rage for the fall. Wink. No, don't wear this in your hair. But if you have one at home, you can hold it next to your ear and just very gently manipulate it. It makes some really great sounds.
going to very gently put it over your ear and you let me know if it feels okay up your face a little bit too. Just close your eyes for me. at different times and the room I usually film in is very crowded and occupied right now with green screens so the next thing I have is kind of weird but I hope that you'll like it it's a a soft piece of protective foam. I have no idea what was in this originally. I actually hate styrofoam sounds, so I'm not going to be scratching it. I am, however, going to be squishing it because it's very you can see it's very soft so I'm going to bend it around your head
is another sound that gives me the the bad chills but this sounds good to me so I hope that it some styrofoam I like touching this better than I like touching foam foam You can come here as much as you want with it and we're going to switch Thank you. 
very soft. They're made of like fur. Very soft and they're bendable. So I want to use a couple pipe cleaners on you. I'm going to uh, first brush your ears with them. And then I'm going to wrap them around your ears and touch the fur and see if that does anything. Okay? So let's pick some colors. Take. I don't want orange. I don't want yellow. Lilac. White. Use the red to touch your ear. So you got red on you. Okay, I hope this sounds good. All right. side of you so I can reach you easier. Actually, hear the fur, or do you just feel the just feel me touching your ear? Very, very gently. And then around town. Okay. Very gentle.
assorted pipe cleaners and I'm going to wrap them around our ears. Give it a shot. Because they bend. So I should be able to. size of your ear Slip this over your ear because I fitted it. There we go. Almost. Don't want to harm the ear. here. I'm going to fold this down the middle and not sneeze. I lied, I sneezed. You're not going to hear it though. Then, see how that? Focus. Here we go. to create a little jail. going to take my nails and touch the fur on the pipe cleaners.
can actually hear anything. But if you like it, let me know and I'll do it for you another time. In a much longer segment. Okay? These two glue sticks. And they're old. You can tell because they're yellowed. And they're hot glue sticks. And even though they're hard, they're in the sound assortment because when they get hot, they get soft and turn to liquid. I brought two because they make very soft tapping noises. And really good. Isn't that the tisk tisk? Tisk tisk tisk. People used to do. Can you do that? Put your finger sideways. I suppose it's not completely sideways. Can you do this? Star Trek. Can you do this? Bend your ring finger down. Like that. What I can't do, you can do it on this hand. Bend your pinky down. I cannot do it on this hand. Unless I hold, no I can't. I can't. Unless I hold my pinky down like that, I can't keep my ring finger straight if I bend my pinky. No matter how much I try. Sorry. That was a tangent.
shopping than the New Year's now. Those were the hot glue sticks. Have you liked that? kids. This one is a butterfly. You can see its wings. You're my butterfly sugar baby. It has two spots. One there, one there. Butterflies have mirrored designs on their wings. Like that. So you have a butterfly. We have bunny rabbit. It's really cute. Long ears and a little fluffy tail. Then we have a stamp that says Happy Birthday! Happy Birthday! Every time I hear Happy Birthday, I think of Frosty the Snowman. I'll be the H-A-P-P-Y, the name involved. Happy birthday business meeting. It's so festive. You already know. <laughs> Sorry. P. Poop. Why? A pirate with a little peg leg. Jack Sparrow. Oh, then we have a, 
was cute. A little cornucopia with a pumpkin and a fish. Is that a fish? Or is that corn? Oh, it might be corn. <laughs> honestly, honestly. <laughs> I can show you guys what I saw. And then if you still think I'm crazy, you can <laughs> you're probably right. I thought that dot was an eye and that this part was the mouth and it looked like a goblin shark to me. Do you ever see a goblin shark? They have these protruding foreheads and goblin faces. I thought that that was a goblin shark in the cornucopia because that makes perfect sense. And we have, oh, this one's dirty. Little buggy. Punch buggy, no punches back. Another vehicle. Little autobus. Wheels on the bus. Horn on the bus. And last one. A rose. What do you think of when you see a rose? Do you think that you've been kissed by a rose? Do you think of tuxedo mask? Do you think of Beauty and the Beast? My first thought was Beauty and the Beast. This is more of a dense sound. Kind of sticky as well. your eyes if you need to and not off. Okay? Wow. Oh, am 
side was fine. Okay, let's end it on six. last thing that I want to do with you is something that you can't see. So, let's get a few closer eyes anyway. I have the very soft yoga mat around you. Well, yeah, around you. <laughs> and it's textured. It's very soft. So what I'm going to be doing is dragging my nails over it with the ink. And if you would, just sit back and relax. Sounds good. Not scratching your ears, literally. Just, you should be able to hear it very close. the sounds do their job. again. Whispering in your left ear while I scratch next to your right. Whispering in your right ear as I scratch next to your left. hopes that it goes away. Got it? Whispering in your right ear, now your left ear, and scratching in both ears. Do that again. Holy man.
for tuning. I hope that you're fast asleep. Or that you're super tingly. And I'll see you soon with a new video. And some very exciting news. For real. For giving this a shot. Please let me know what you liked, what you didn't like, and I will try to make better videos for you based on that feedback. So for now, good night. so I can get a clear view of you and should be sturdy enough.